Hello everyone. Today we are going to analyze the film Alike by Daniel Martinez Lara. Alike is a short film about creativity and imagination and how the system stifles or disregards them today. Daniel Martinez Lara. Daniel Martinez Lara was born in 1972 in Madrid, Spain. He is a Spanish animator and head of Peep Cool Lab. Award He received Goya Award for Best Animated Short Film, Alike, in 2016. He carried out his professional activity in three areas, which is animation school, Peep School Land. On the other hand, he combines the creation of his own short films and finally designing and developing animation tools like Blender, Grease Pencil, Keymesh, and Easy Rigging. He has worked in films, advertising, and series with various companies such as Indian Animated Studios, Pyro Studios, Rem Infographica, or Furia Digital among others, and usually participates as a speaker at conferences and festivals. His film includes Hero, which is a steampunkish action-packed tale with a twist ending, with two rival heroes fighting for control of a mysterious glowing artifact that provides power and life to their respective homelands. Changes Changes is somewhat similar to the movie Alike. It has same character which the movie Alike has. Changes present one main character with a strong internal conflict created by a conflict with the informant, accompanied by a crowd of undifferentiated characters. I like in a short film about creativity and imagination and how the system stifles or disregards them today. This is shown through the relationship between a father and his son. The father who has already been affected by the system seems to use his son to keep his color. I feel the color in their skin symbolizes how they are still creative and happy. Although the father copy doesn't seem as enthusiastic as his son pays, he seems happy and likes how his son seems to love the world around him. Pace one day encounters a solo violin player in a patch of color in an otherwise colorless world. Although Pace seems to enjoy it and does not want to leave to school, Copy drags him away. As the workday goes on, we see Copy's color fade, showing how he becomes a part of mass number of people working with him, emotionless and just going through the motions. When the day ends, he uses Pace to bring his color back. But as the day go by, Pace slowly begins to lose his enthusiastic, jumpy character as well as fade a little bit. His father notices this when he does not return to his original color anymore. So he takes Pace to see the violin, bringing a smile to his face right away. When they reach the spot, the violinist is not there, and Pace turns to leave looking disappointed. When he turns around, he sees his father standing in the middle of the park, playing an imaginary violin, making copies color back and bringing a smile to face face. This animation really pulled at my heart strength, especially because of the soundtrack. There is no talking in this film. The entire song consists of an instrumental piece which goes along with the ups and downs of the story. I feel the music along with the expressions and body language of the characters help tell the story of the father and son excellently. I like how the use of bright colors as well as lack of them really help visualize the mental state of the characters. I also really liked how the background fades to just white in scenes where they have a moment, like the first hug that demonstrates how Copy gets back his color. This allows a distraction to interrupt that moment between them. Let's analyze the film in little more details. From the moment we are born, society begins teaching us lessons. Some lessons are good and some lessons can prove to be harmful. While on the one hand we can learn things like look both ways before crossing the street or go to school, get a job, go to work and provide for your family. 
on the other hand the way in which we teach humans to grow up is an endless cycle of progression that leaves very little room for creativity this shot is a very accurate bitter sweet look how life can sometimes dull us a little this movie is made in monochrome only the three characters copy paste and the violinist has color in them rest others as well as surrounding is shown as colorless which symbolizes how emotionless the world has been i feel the color in their skin symbolizes how they are still creative and happy it develops some of the themes that can be found in martinez lara's previous short changes including work routine and alienation and incorporates them into the experience of a child and that of a father and son relationship where the father tries to teach the right path to his son movie starts with a scene where father copy gets ready for work and prepares his son for school he start to pack paste bag with lots of heavy books but when he closes the bag the bag takes its former shape which shows the amount of pressure society is putting on a kid the saturated colors are used to portray the changes in the characters as well as the alienation of the city which contrasts with the saturated colors used for the green small park where the violin player is located and for the kids drawing which symbolizes creativity gestalt theory gestalt theory emphasizes that the whole of anything is greater than its part that is the attribute of the whole are not deducible from analysis of parts in isolation this shot by daniel martinez lara is a great example of gestalt theory it uses most of the principles proximity when we see elements which are spaced out we see them as different object similarity we group similar elements with same characteristic continuity we move our eyes from one object to another as we would follow path until it is interrupted order the belief that alignment and symmetry are attractive and central elements of design realism sometimes called naturalism in the arts is generally the attempt to represent subject matters truthfully or without artificiality and avoiding speculative fiction and supernatural elements alike a pixar like film by madrid based animator daniel martinez lara is a 8 minute lesson on what happens to your life when creativity is destroyed by the daily grind society tells us to excel in school work as hard as we can and eventually teach our kids to do the same it is an endless cycle that leaves virtually no room for creativity this short film encourages people to look at things differently which is truly amazing it is also about being a parent and the importance of letting kids create their own journeys the critically acclaimed short film was made entirely with blender an open source 3d rendering program and is dedicated to our families for helping us not to lose our color daniel movies are unique because they not only move the characters but also move the audience through the heartwarming stories